today. From FedEx Field in Landover, Maryland. It's the NFC Wild Card Round on EA Sports. We'll see the Washington Commanders taking on the Detroit Lions. For my money, it's the best time of the year. Playoff football time as postseason action descends upon FedEx Field just outside of D.C. Straight ahead, it's wild card weekend, and we've got a great one in store between the Detroit Lions and the Washington Commanders. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the postseason on EA Sports. We have a developing situation here. Following the interception, a golden chance for points as the offense is back out there with a first and goal to go. Swift will take this one in. It's a Lions touchdown. Just power football there down near the goal line. Give it to him. He's able to push his way across. Yeah, they went heavy there. Sometimes you have those big offensive linemen come in have to report like they're eligible. But all they're doing is getting a good stance, blocking, and getting their runner across the goal line. This offense has marched the ball down the field nicely. In good position, can they finish the drive off? First and 10 in the red zone. Back to throw now on first down. Open man, and he's got Williams. Touchdown, Lions. An 11-yard touchdown. And the Lions go coast to coast and finish the drive off with six points. All the receivers in the league are plenty good enough. Otherwise, they wouldn't make it in the NFL. But the ones that go. Okay, the field goal unit out on the field as they look to get three points here in the waning moments of this first half. The kick by Pinheiro is good, and that'll move their lead up to four now. The key coming up here, preserve the lead for this defense. Fourth quarter, close game. Third down, here we go. On third down, he'll drop to throw. Man open, it's St. Brown, he's got it. And he will be brought down at about the six-yard line. Here's Swift, and he's going to press this one forward as they stop him right around the one. Five yards, a good run there, and now second and goal. As long as you've been the air attack, has gotten him down here, but now's where you start to lean on that running game. That's a good pickup there on first and goal. And they'll turn to the power game to try to get in. Trying to keep those big legs churning, but he's going to go down in the backfield. This is a big play in this wild card matchup, facing third and goal. Back to throw, sliding out of the pocket. He's got his man. It's caught for a lion touchdown. Austin Hooper, a two-yard touchdown grab. And the Lions are an extra point away from taking the lead here in the fourth. No surprise there, third and goal down here. That's where they're going to look for their tight end. A big
big drive now for this offense. They'll have all three timeouts and the two-minute warning as they search for a late score. Got to try it here. He's back to throw. Got Say Brown running the quick slant here. And he is going to have the Lions first down as they'll get the conversion on a gain of 14. Fourth down, no problem. Just a ho-hum pickup of 14 to keep the offense on the field. They'll look to throw here on first down. They'll try and set up the screen to Swift. And they'll get this down to the 42-yard line. A 14-yard pickup. That's 14 yards on two straight plays. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one-score game. Ready, set. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. And they're going to work this down to about the 32-yard line. First down now, but that clock rolling. He'll look to throw. And this would have been intercepted if he could have gotten the feet in. He didn't, so it's incomplete. Boy, that one really could have turned this thing upside down. Limited time left on the clock after that incompletion, so I think both sides are going to savor every second to prepare before the next snap. Because once the ball's in motion, it may be a nonstop push to finish this drive off. Everyone better be on the same page right now, because I think they're going to try and get several plays off in quick succession if they can. Open man right side is St. Brown. And he's going to have a gain of 11 to the 11 before he's brought down. First and 10. From the gun, here's Swift. And he'll fight his way down inside the 10 to the 9-yard line. Clock rolling here, about to hit 30 seconds. Back to throw. A quick throw knocked away and incomplete. Third and long coming up defensively. You pressure the quarterback or drape all over the passing lane? Yes, that's exactly what you do. It's both because they're not mutually exclusive. They may have been at one time in football, but not anymore. You want to have that pressure. If you have a big-time pass rusher, send him after the quarterback. And, then and this is caught. Touchdown. And they've taken the lead here in the final minute. Well, that is the definition, Charles, of delivering under pressure. The game-winning potential. There's still a little time left on the clock, but the potential game-winning drive, and it was well executed. I think we're going to remember this possession for a long time. We've called a bunch of games, but how about how they got it done down the stretch? And a wild card win moves them on to the divisional round. Everyone plays all year long for the right to get into the tournament, as they like to call it. Wild card, divisional, doesn't matter to them. One moves on, one goes home. So that'll do it for my partner, Charles Davis, and the best darn crew in the industry. I'm Brandon Gaunt, and this has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. With that, we sign off from Landover.